New this morning, uh, it is no secret we are living in stressful times. That stress could be leading to broken hearts, literally. A new study finds cases of broken heart syndrome increasing during the pandemic. Josh Navarro, live outside our studio with more on this this morning. Josh, good morning. Good morning to you, Mark. We can experience an emotional tone when it comes to stress, but medical experts are reminding us this morning that it, it is important for us to manage it because our organs can also be affected. Now, broken heart syndrome, also called stress cardiomyopathy, uh, has symptoms similar to a heart attack, for example, shortness of breath or chest pain. However, people with broken heart syndrome usually do not have blocked arteries. Instead, stress changes the shape of the heart, which affects its ability to pump blood Effectively. Now, we're all experiencing different types of stress right now, from job loss to social isolation and even concerns about getting the virus. I spoke to a cardiologist from Rochester Regional Health about this, and here's what he had to say. Anything that is a big stress on your body can cause it. So it's not just COVID. It can be um, a, a car accident or, or a death of a loved one can, can provoke it. April and May, when it was bad here, uh, we had several of those cases and luckily the, the nice thing about the broken heart syndrome is if it's recognized and treated appropriately, um, almost everybody survives and the heart function returns to, to normal. Now, medical experts say it's important to deal with stress through self-care, including exercise, meditation, and prayer. It's also important to stay connected with family and friends virtually or on the phone or socially distant. We're outside of the News 8 studios. I'm Josh Namarro, News 8. All right, Josh, thank you. We posted the results of that study on our website as well. You can find that at rochesterfirst.com.